Okay, so today's video, the angle's weird, but it's because I'm running errands at the same time I'll do a video, because this one I'm just kind of talking like the last one. Um, you might hear the AC again. I brought the camera closer to me, so maybe like the mic will catch it better. This was like my first suggestion ever for a video, and I'm just like, oh my god, like a suggestion, and like people, something that people actually want to see. Oh my god. My suggestion was about talking about like the double standard and stuff like things that girls could do guys can't do and why is that or how do I feel about it so let's go um I should probably put a trigger warning I'm going to talk about sensitive things in this video so like if you're really sensitive to like sexual harassment and rape and stuff like that please stop watching because I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings or not feelings or bring flashbacks or any of that that's really bad so yeah rape sexual harassment catcalling it's disgusting. One, people only believe like, oh, only women can get raped. No, guys get raped too. They are, there are men out there who can easily get raped by a woman. It doesn't matter how, you can't say, oh, he's not a man if he's able to get raped by a woman. Buzzy, buzzy, blah. It happens, like, believe him. What a woman wears and what a woman is doing or where a woman is at the moment does not determine whether or not she was asking for it or that she wanted the sex or that she wanted to be, you know, sexually harassed. Nobody wants to be sexually harassed. There should be no idea of like, oh, she should be grateful. Like, he could have had sex with anyone and he chose to have sex with her. She's being so like ungrateful and blah, 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 like that he chose her. Are you stupid? That's not how sex works. Okay? Sex works with consent. Okay? And consent can... Consent, that's, that's, that's another blurry thing. Because like, yeah, I know it's the whole like, make sure she says yes. But then it's like, I don't want to be awkward. And then, 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 If you're that iffy about it, about whether or not she wants it, then you probably shouldn't be doing anything. And same goes for the girl. If you're pretty iffy, then just don't, just don't do it. Or like I said, just straight up ask, listen, is this okay? And that's it. Woo! Woohoo! Consensual sex. It sucks that like lately rape and all that has been like a crazy topic. Um, or whatever. It just shouldn't happen. Hitting your partner or somebody of the opposite sex. I'm gonna be honest. I am one of those very handsy girlfriends and I don't know my limits and I get very touchy. But I have been lucky enough to never come across a guy who would you know, go as far as hit me back. But yeah, that should I shouldn't be doing that and the guy shouldn't be doing that. And I mean, I, I don't wanna, this isn't like tough love or whatever the hell you wanna call it. But if you're a girl and you're hitting your boyfriend and you know, you keep on and you're like, keep pushing it and pushing it, there's gonna be a point that he's gonna snap, he's gonna beat your ass. And I'm not saying beating women is okay, I'm not. Trust me, I'm not. But if they're like legit warning you uh, that's your sign to be like, let me fall back, this is not okay, I should not be doing this. If you get irked enough, even by like a little kid, you're gonna hit a little kid. So you're just a female. I mean, no matter how I say it, it's gonna come out bad. She go without saying, guys shouldn't hit girls. I'm not saying that's okay, because if a guy hits a girl and she hits back and they keep hitting, then that's, that's gonna be a mess. Anything is messy once you get your genitals, your hands, or your opinions involved. I mean, opinions are good, but you know, when they're like bad opinions, like, I hate this selective group of people, stuff gets messy. This was like a big one, and I have had group conversations with guys and girls multiple times about this one. There's always the thing of like, I would feel weird if my, my mom or my dad's watching this part, just because it's like, it's an inappropriate thing. But there's this thing where it's like, you know, what was it? The topic was, why is it that a girl takes longer to give, you know, oral stuff than it is for a guy? And I thought that was the stupidest question. A guy could talk and talk and talk and talk and talk and be like, I do this and I do it like this. And you know, and I love doing it, and I do it like that, and like that, and like that, and like that. You know, I'm not gonna get descriptive, but you know what I'm saying. And then, as soon as a girl says anything close to like, I enjoy doing it, she's a hoe, 
she's a slut how dare she say that i can't believe she said that she's dirty it should go both ways i'm not saying everybody should brag about the stuff that they do but it's like if it's okay for one to do it it should be okay for the other a guy has more over a girl if they're like yo she did this or whatever than a girl if she's like oh he did that you know like i feel like a female would have to have way more trust in a guy in order to do that than to have sex. You know what I mean? It's like, sex is a two-way thing. It's like, you both agree to this, you're just as bad as the other person. You're like, oh, 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 I screwed the hoe. It's like, yeah, you screwed the hoe. But then it's like, she did this to me. It was like, it's a one-way thing. And it's your fault for doing it, you know? And that's that's how they, they play it. They play it or whatever. Come on. It's, it's so stupid. Here goes the freaking thing that like, pisses me off all the time when you know a guy messes with a girl you know and she posts her memes and she's like dudes ain't shit dudes ain't this that and the third la, 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 la. and they always want to claim you know that guys are so complicated and then guys you know when they get in their feelings and they want to be vulnerable and stuff they're like girls ain't shit girls this that and the third blah, 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 blah. To be honest, I just think the remedies are that explore your options. If there's a pattern in the females that you deal with or the boys that you deal with, then, you know, it's just kind of your type. There's great people out there. Like, I thought that way for a hot minute and then I was just like, I only deal with dudes who are just like trash. And I dealt with one who wasn't trash and I was like, okay it's all right and that's all it takes let it happen don't look for anything it'll come to you okay don't even get me started on this positive energy stuff that's for another video the stars the universe energy karma Oof. okay so i'm in the midst of getting ready so i took a shower and you know i'm doing face mask and i'm eating pineapples so sorry for the whatever the friend zone Guys make the friend zone seem like such a bad place. It is not a bad place. I've had to friend zone a lot of guys, or like pre-friend zone. Like I've hung out with guys, and then I'm, I'll let them know. Like, I'm like, listen, I want a friendship, and that's it. And if you want more than that, then uh, we can't. Like, no, I probably won't see you anymore. I want to be, you know, I just want, I just want to be in the friend zone. Like, I want to just have friends and nothing more. You're just a guy. I'm just a girl. We, we we exchange ideas being friends with guys is so cool but they just want like vagina and it's like no you know I can give you honesty and good 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 solid friendship you know friendship but no and then they try to be like oh it could be like friends who kiss no no. The last time that happened, that was my boyfriend of like two and a half-ish years. No. It's just it's just gonna escalate. We're gonna end it together. And I don't want that. And that's another thing. Both genders, well all genders, I should say. Just be straightforward. Just like say what it is and what it isn't. Like I have I, like I said before, I have talked to people who straight up told me like I want nothing more than just like mess around with you and I'm like no that's not what I want so mm, but that's better I'd, I'd be better off with that than somebody who lied and said oh like I want to be your friend and then tries to put their hand on my pants and I'm like I thought it was a friendship and then I start getting angry disappointed thought you were better than that it's a whole sh blech. it's different if, like you both start off as friends you both kind of gradually start like each other do you that's a cute little love story have fun but if you know what you want don't don't stick around people who know what you want and don't respect you enough to let you have that I think that is all I've got to say yeah have a nice week I love everybody here mm -hmm.